Here are the option choices for design subjects this year. They are GCSE 3D design, GCSE textiles design and GCSE graphic design. Locally in Leeds and surrounding areas there are many many job and career opportunities within the design industry. Leeds now sits at the heart of the UK's creative industry sector, growing twice as fast as other sectors and employing over 2 million people. There are many, many different career paths in design, from being an architect to graphic designer, from fashion design to 3D design, and it could be video games or theatre set designer. It's a never ending list of vocations. So let's talk about 3D design. This replaced the old woodwork type qualification. It's not called woodwork anymore. 3D design is not the same as woodwork. We work with many different materials to make a 3D final outcome for our projects. You'll learn about different designers and design movements to come up with your own ideas for, for a 3D outcome. It could be architectural models, product design, exhibition design, jewelry design or interior design. And here on this slide are some examples of the product design project. You can also watch the videos on YouTube that I've put on there um, on art and design, crochet art and design. If you want to subscribe, that'd be great. There's lots of different videos on there for you to look at for the different type of courses that we do in design as well. So also, in, um, we also do architecture and we look at different existing architects to look at that up designing our own art gallery or library or sports centre we could do that in a modernist style or organic style there's some images on there that's that type of work that you'd be doing in to, to create this project architectural project some careers that link with 3d design is architecture product designer interior designer exhibition design as well could be that part of 3d design Now let's go on to GCSE graphic design. So this option is based all around producing your own artwork for a graphic product. You will learn how to use Photoshop, just like an in industry. Some of the jobs in graphics include graphic designer, web page designer, game designer, packaging designer and illustration. And there are some examples of students' graphic design work that they've done in the last couple of years. And this project is based around logo design and packaging design. In this course as well, you'd learn up to use Photoshop to manipulate images to create your own album cover on the band or singer of your choice. So you don't you don't just go on Photoshop, you have to do a bit of sketching as well and some lino printing work. The video images at the top, those are last year's GCSE students' work. Careers that link, obviously, a graphic designer, so you could be designing logos, packaging, web designer, web page designer, animators, anything to do with branding as well, or packaging is also on there. So let's move on to textiles design. So choose, students can choose their own route through this course, from fashion design to costume design, surface patterns, soft furnishings, and many more that are listed there. It involves learning how to use a sewing machine and to construct garments or textile products as well. And surface pattern also goes under that, the umbrella of textiles design. And this is some work that some of our years, year 11 did a couple of years ago. They designed a dress based around the theme of under the sea. So on there you can see different shapes of um, sea animals that have been created into a final idea for a dress. So obviously I've talked about the YouTube channel, it's Crawshaw Art and Design channel. Um, there's plenty of videos on there with my modelling sketchbooks that you can have a look at. So the type of thing that you will be doing under these courses. So careers in textile design, you could be obviously a fashion designer, textile designer, surface pattern designer, which is a very good occupation to do. They design things like book covers, um, also cushions, fabrics that you wear, 
anything like that. We talked about that in year eight, actually, and what a, fashion, um, a textile designer does. So to summarise the three different subjects, 3D design is basically working in 3D and then product is going to be A3, but a, a 3D, but please don't think it's woodwork. You work in different materials for this course. GCSE graphic design is a lot of work on Photoshop, so that's on computers, but you do still need to do a bit of sketching for your own artwork to go into your final graphic products as well. And GCSE textile uh, design, you'll be learning how to use a sewing machine and using other embellishment techniques like felting, batiking, to come up with a final product that either is wearable or it could be a bag or soft furnishings. Also, there are different skills that you learn in design that suit um, employers really do look at um, these skills when they employ somebody, such as um, work ready, creativity, innovation and problem solving. So in year 11, we have a design trip to London in December, travel by train to London, it's just for the day. We visit various galleries and famous landmarks. So you also get to get to see, get to see the Christmas lights and markets because we do go in December, which is really, really, really good. So there's some pictures there of last year's trip. We've gone the underground and there was 45 students that I took down to London, obviously with other staff, not just me. So again, this is the actual um, YouTube channel, ProShaw Academy A&D, and you'll find that this, this getting over, well, there's quite, quite a few subscribers that are on there, and some of my videos are on there to show you what, what type of work you'd be doing for this course. So have a look. You don't have to subscribe, but just have a look at the um, GCSC modelling um, videos on there. And also you can follow us on Twitter at ProShaw Design Tech. Thank you for listening.